The fourth group is similar to the third one, but A is the unknown and F is the given variable. This set of problems ask you to calculate uniform series of equal payments A to be invested for n number of time periods at interest rate of I and accumulated future value of all payments or equivalent future value is F. This set of problems can be summarized with the factor A over F or A slash F. The left side of the slash sign is the unknown parameter. Uh, here it is A and the right side is the given variable which is F. Equation 1-3 for uniform series compound among factor can be rewritten for A as unknown to solve these problems which gives the equation 1-4. Equation 1-4 can determine uniform series of equal investments A for accumulated future value F number of uh, investment period N and interest rate I. We can write this equation according to the factor notation A equals F times the factor A over F. This factor is called the sinking fund deposit factor and it, and it is displayed by A slash F. The factor is used to calculate a uniform series of equal end of the period payments A that are equivalent to a future sum F. Uh, for example, referring to example 1-7 in previous video, uh, let's say you plan to have $200,000 after 20 years and you are offered an investment uh, which can be the imaginary saving account that gives you 6% per year compound interest rates uh, and you want to know how much money equal payments you need to save each year or invest uh, deposit in your account in the end of each year. So in summary, you want to have $200,000 after 20 years and you can invest your money with 6% interest rate. The question is how much you need to invest per year. Again, the first step is drawing the timeline. Left hand side is the present time. We won't have any payment. So there is no payment at present time or time zero. Right hand side is a future. And you want to have a single amount of $200,000. So you write $200,000 in the 20th year or in the end of right hand side of the timeline. Note that $200,000 has the same time dimension as the last payment A. Both are uh, in the year 20th. Your investment takes 20 years, so N equals 20. And above each year, you have to write A, uh, which is unknown and needs to be calculated. So F equals 2 hundred thousand uh, dollars n number of years is 20 i interest rate six percent and a needs to be calculated we can use the factor notation to summarize the equation in this factor i is six percent n is 20 and f is given and a needs to be calculated and we calculate the result so if you want to have $200,000 in 20 years from now with 6% interest rate, you will need to invest equal amounts of $5,437 per year at the end of each year for 20 years starting from year one. 